Hi, I'm Mad, and I'm addicted to Doc Martens. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Mad. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel if you are new. If you are new, make sure you click that subscribe button. Become part of the Mad Threads family. It's a fun time over here. I promise. I swear every single time I film a video, my hair gets longer and I just don't ever know what to do with it. Help, please. Like I... Anyways, so today's video is going to be another video about Doc Martens. You may have seen my Doc Martens collection video. It kind of went a little viral. Okay, not viral. It got like a lot of views for my channel. So that was really exciting and I'm so glad you guys showed so much love and support on that video. So thank you guys. And I thought I would do like a little bit of a follow-up video and tell you guys what my favorite Docs are that I own. So I'm going to be sharing with you my top five favorite pairs of Doc Martens that I have. One of these is actually a new pair that I didn't show in my collection video but I'm going to go into really in-depth detail about each pair of shoes that I'm going to show you today so if you guys wanted to maybe buy your first pair of docs or you're just looking for a new pair you can kind of get all the tea all the information all the facts right here but let's get started I'm going to show you guys my top five favorite Doc Martens of all time pair number one is one that you guys know like if you follow me on anything including YouTube, you will know that my Jaden XLs are literally my soulmates. Honestly, these babies are chunky, thick. Boy, he thick! They are no longer sold on the site, but I did find mine on Depop. I searched high and low for these babies. They are so beautiful. I feel like they were really limited because they were really only out for like two months. I only saw them in stores for like a month and then they were just like gone by. See you later. I'm done with this business, but they are just so beautiful and y'all know I wear these all the time literally every time I post a fit pic It's probably in these they have eight eyelets, but they're the silver o-ring eyelets oh, They're so beautiful. What I really love about them is the white stitching So instead of your classic yellow Doc Martin stitching, it's all white including the back the sides all this detailing and then we have this ring on the back and then you have your classic black and yellow tag, so that's how you can distinguish these as docks. And they have the Jaden platform sole. So they're just chunky and nice and beautiful, and I just love them so much. You could wear a really simple outfit and throw these on, and it will look like you tried really hard. You could also wear like a very intense, like just grungy outfit, and it's perfect. Chef's kiss. These ones I purchased for around $200. I purchased so much stuff on Depop, y'all. It's like not good. These are the Jaden XLs. I'm in love. They're just the best thing that ever happened to me. And that's the tea and the facts on those. Shoe number two. These have to be my most worn docks of all time. They were my third pair. So I've had them for years and they are so beat up and clocked and scuffed and gross. My love for them will just, it will never go away. These are the Jaden Cherry Reds. So as you can see, they are beats of the gods. I've worn these more than I've probably worn at the, any other shoe in my whole lifetime. So these ones again have the Jaden sole, so nice and chunky. These ones are a little bit big on me. I This was the first pair of Jadens I got and I didn't realize how big they run, but I just love this color so much. I feel like you can add this color to literally any outfit and it always works every time. I love that they have a zipper and I love the yellow stitching against the red shoe. They're just beautiful. I love them so much. I feel like I will wear these for the rest of my life. So I paid $140 for these. I got these on Depop. I'm obsessed with them. I've had them for like years. So I'm just such a fan. And I would always recommend a pair of Jadens regardless of the color. Jadens are the best Doc Martin style. I feel like they go with every outfit, with every body type, like they just are so flattering on anyone I see wearing them. So 10 out of 10 recommend, get yourself Jadens, you will not be disappointed. Okay, so this next pair that I have is one of the two pair, two or three pairs that I've bought retail. All of my other docs are thrifted. They're classic 1460s, which usually I always prefer a platform as you'll see as a recurring theme in this video. But these just hit 
different for some reason. These are the 1460 vegan chromes and you can tell that they're vegan because of the light colored tag and I put yellow laces in here. They do come with just regular black laces but I love these round yellow laces that I got from the dock store in Herald Square in New York City. I have scuffed these up a bit with the chrome. It's very very easy to scuff them just because it's not the most sturdy finish so easy to scuff i just think that these are such a twist on a classic shoe like the 1460s and i have the regular black 1460s but the chrome just it just hits different it's beautiful they're comfy they're easy to break in because they're the vegan leather and i think that these costed around 120 when i got them i don't know if they make these anymore but i am sure you could find these on depop they released with a few other colors i think this is from their limited edition holiday collection in like 2016 or 17. but yeah these were my second pair of docs ever and the moment i got these they did not leave my feet for probably a year like I wore these year round all the time. They're just such a classic shoe once again. It has yellow stitching, the black lining, like they're just beautiful and I wear them all the time still. Okay, so my next favorite pair are these beauties. You guys know I love these as well. These are the 1461 Bex Soul. I actually thrifted these from Buffalo Exchange in New York City in Chelsea. I think they were somewhere around $30, but I got them brand new, which was a steal. And I have barely broken these in and I got them probably a year ago. They're just so classic, so beautiful. And I love the Bex Soul because it's kind of like a mix between the regular Soul, so like this baby Soul, and the Jaden sole. It's just like an in-between. So they're not as flat as the regular sole and they're not as chunky as the Jaden sole. And honestly, I love these because they can be classy, but they can also be edgy. They can be business casual, but they can just be, mm, they're just, there's so many things. And I love that about them because I could wear them with like a skirt and like higher socks, or I could wear them with trousers and a button-down top honestly i love that about these they're so versatile they're cute they're they're comfy but they are very difficult to break in let me tell you that right now because with the boots your ankles moving around in them but these have no ankle so it just destroys the back of your heel what can you do it's worth it beauty is pain and you should buy these <laughs> all right y'all i'm about to reveal to you my new pair of docs and they have already made it to my top five list they are not going anywhere anytime soon i know probably gonna get a million comments about you should sell these to me i waited so long to get my hands on these shoes and i just cannot believe that they're sitting on my lap right now and if y'all are doc lovers you will know the moment you see these exactly <laughs> the type of struggle that i went through to get them moment of silence please these are the lazy oaf heart buckle boots i cannot i can't, i can't even express to you the amount of coins they're like a pristine museum display and i never thought i would own these because the resale is absolutely insane the drops with lazy oaf docks are so limited i found them for 350 dollars on depop and your girl got a bargain and i got them for like 300 expensive yes worth it absolutely what i do wish is that the stitching was hot pink and that the tag was also hot pink but win some and lose some so the back has the pink suede heart we have the silver heart buckle the tongue has another suede heart now these are also the jade and soul if you're a docs lover you know these were definitely worth the money i was scared that they weren't going to be but i have to say these are the most incredibly snug perfect fitting docs i have ever worn in my life they are not broken in i got them brand new in the box with tags they feel like they are broken in because they fit my foot so well, all in favor of us finding these in jack size and us getting matching lazy over our buckle boots. I'm in favor. So if you are considering getting the lazy oaf docks and you can afford it and you really want to do that to yourself, 
do it. It's worth it. Get them on Depop. Also, I'm just obsessed with Lazy Oaf. Would y'all be interested in seeing like a Lazy Oaf collection video? Because your girl's down. Like, I'll do it. That is it for my top five favorite Doc Martens. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please let me know what your favorite pair of Docs is down below. I actually made a video telling you guys everything you need to know before buying your first pair of Docs. So definitely check out that video if you haven't already. And that's it. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, guys. One, two, three. Fuck it.